Now we did just get a little interaction here. Yeah, it was very quick and very brief. The male got up and chased the, the cubs away or the youngsters away. And gave them a bit of a growl. Came out there quite quickly. It was wonderful to see. But now he's gone and climbed or basically moved right back behind the bush again. Let's see. He may move out. I wonder where he's going to go. Cindy, you asked if. Oh, watch, there he he's going to come again, maybe. Hold on. These, these youngsters are clearly very hungry. They want to get to this kill. Now, Cindy, you asked if the lionesses might push, it, uh, push and Tina out. Watch, he's going to come again, perhaps. Um, if they would push him off of the kill so that these youngsters could feed. I'm not sure, Cindy. Um, possibly, but also the lionesses don't want to risk injury. And he looks like he's really intent on protecting. That kill. Oh, listen to. Okay, I think. Why don't we try IR? Do you want to try that first? Should we put it on? There we go. Sure. It's quite chilly this evening. Eesh. Are you getting cold, folks? Yeah, it's two days in. <laughs> Two layers already. Mm -hmm. Jeez. Okay, I've only got one layer on. Oh, that's great. Infrared now. This is wonderful to see something different. Now, um, as I said, these youngsters is one, two, three, four, five of them here. I can see. You see another one at the back there, Fergs? I can't. I just see five of them. Yeah. And just the there was one lying in the grass. Yeah, there could possibly be another one at the back there, or maybe he's lying with the lionesses. <sighs> Gee. <sighs> These lions stink, everybody. <sighs> oh, shit. <laughs> <sighs> that is not a pleasant smell. I think they are suffering from a bit of gas from zebra. From the zebra. <laughs> Ooh, no. <laughs> that is a foul smell. <laughs> Not good. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> this show must go on. <laughs> And we were sitting here, and these these lions. I mean, they were quite quite calm and and um, just resting. And then all of a sudden, this male came out. Uh, Justin, you asked what it smells like. Did you say does it smell like dog or rot? Um, uh, Justin. <laughs> and, um, Justin, it no, it smells like. I don't know if I could describe it. Um, um, almost a bit of uh, rotten meat. Um, I would say. Fergs, what do you think? A meaty part. <laughs> <laughs> says it smells like a meaty fart. <laughs> I don't know if we can say that while we live, Fergus. Can <laughs> if that's a black dot next to my name, I do apologize. <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> Now, the 
person who describes smells the best is, of course, James Crocodile Dundee Hendry. Let's head across to him now and see what he is up in the morrow.